You know what's funny? Good, I can really only oh, do it if I'm, if I'm doing like Chris, Chris Hemsworth. Hemsworth. Yeah, because he talks like I can this. talk like this. Hey? Yeah. So, oh, right, right. Right. It's a little bit of British in yeah, there. He is, but he sounds a little British sometimes. Well, depends yeah. on that where you are. That sounds like Jason Statham. No, 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 no. Yeah, I'm about to say, doesn't no, he? No, no. And, Chris, hear and, British and, British and Christian Bale. No, 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 no. Oh, I'm Batman. I know for sure. No, no, that's, no British, that's, that's British. Oh, yeah, no, mate, no, British. You know why? No. It's your O's. Yeah. No. 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 Yeah. Steady. You're cool. saying you're going no, no, no. That's British. Yeah. yeah. No. He no. Says, I mean, whatever. good day. Good day. No, that's British. Yeah, it is. Really? Sounds more British. Wow. Yeah. Good day, well, Jason mate. Statham is more like, what the hell did you just well, say? The, yeah, that's, that's Jason. It sounds exactly yeah, it sounds the, same. the same. No, no. Yeah, it sounds. No. You're still. No. They're all the slight same. And then Joe, 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 do Irish. Go ahead, Joe. I can't, I can't, I can't do it. <laughs> yeah, you got to do the same thing. You got to oh, do Jason Statham. Yeah. What did you just say? No, no, no. Scottish. Scottish. What did you Scan just say? Scandinavian. <laughs> what did you just oh, say? Wait a minute. <laughs> wait a minute. Here. Uh, yeah, Jason Statham's great. But anyway, I love I Australia. Love I, went, oh, I, yeah. I went all over there. I caught all these incredible like reptiles, met all these like incredible cool. people. And what I really love about Australia what is that get there? they represent... Uh, they, wait, hold on, wait. Uh, they they are cool with animal people, in in particular mm. reptile men is what they call you. They're like, oh, you're a reptile man. That's cool, mate. Because you you Steve Irwin and all really, Is that when you have really dry elbows, no, really dry no, knees, no. they call you reptile man? Yeah, reptile man. Yeah, they, they, they <laughs> like appreciate it. When you say that... Scaly you, skin. Like in America here, you get like, oh, yeah. that's cool. What a freak! Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but in Australia, you get like genuine, like, oh, that's that's great, mate. No, that's really cool. I love yeah, you know, yeah. it. Well, reptiles there are regarded as as dogs are here. Like they're the same. Dogs and reptiles are regarded well, equally. Just, they're so not, one is not an outlier. Not really. No, what not the really. Hell but are you in talking Australia, about? So in Australia, what do you mean? What the hell am I kids talking? Kids are talking. You don't see kids walking like lizards no, on leashes all over the that. place. Let Crazy. me. Let yeah. me. No. I dogs and lizards I mean, are the I same. Would. Let me clarify. Look, honey, a puppy. No, a bearded dragon, which are from Australia, by the way. Amazing. Let me clarify, okay, as to my intent with that statement. All right. What I was saying is that that here. There is when when you say lizard versus dog, it's like it's not even in the same universe. Like oh, lizard. Oh, okay. I don't think li I don't, I don't think it, but, well, okay because they're different dog species. Person. But there's a love for reptiles there. There is an appreciation for appreciation, that species. That yeah. yes, I think that is that is more on par with an appreciation for it's, other domesticated animals. It's it's across the board with Australians as a, a young children. Okay, they have they go out and they're taught about the environment. Yeah. The ocean, how yeah. to swim, all these like really I mean, important things isn't we don't do here every, in the U.S. Every Australian so, at the age of seven has to go on a walkabout for three weeks in the wilderness. Andy, and then they, that's, Andy, that's, that's like, Crocodile that's, Dundee. Dude. That's, that's child that's abuse. That's a Crocodile that's, Dundee. Man. No. It happens. No. Wait, no. And you take you on a name. You guys did it to me. You take on a name. <laughs> <laughs> you take on a name. We forced Andy to walk about. No shoes. Dundee. No, but you know Okay, so. No shoes. A little bit of backstory on me. Crocodile Dundee, including the soundtrack. Of I wow. one of my favorite movie. movies wow. ever of wow. all time. Wow. Oh, it hits me. Wow. It gets me. Anyways, wow. I grew up wow. loving Australia. Wow. What's that thing? He looks like you're. No, oh, I. From my yeah. angle, it looked like you were doing something else. Oh, Creepy God. over there. My God. arm is three feet away from my face. What the hell? What is it doing? Don't compliment yourself. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, <laughs> just kidding. Uh, no, but that uh, movie was. Wow. Oh my gosh. He's a Sheila. Or whatever. I Sheila. absolutely still sound like Jason Statham. Okay, well, just you it's say it then. It's all Statham. She's a Sheila. I mate. love Jason Statham. Whatever. Oh, yeah. Roll it over and over, mate. No, roll it over. What the over, hell mate. are you talking Hold about? Hold on. Um, what are you talking roll about? Roll it over. He's doing that thing you were doing. Roll no. it over. No, no, no talking about the alligator. Yeah, croc oh, crocodile. Oh, when he gets crocodile. Roll that's right. Over and over. He'll roll you. Oh, He'll yeah. Take you down what under, a great scene. To the bottom. And roll you over and over. Oh, that's great. That's so Well, hello there, Mr. His friend. The guy in that oh, movie, the I got to hear an Australian accent Mickey's, now. Mickey's, uh, he's quite the guy. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's, yeah, yeah. That's, yeah, that's, that's so guy. good, dude. Yeah, that's he's so, so good. good. Yeah, he's he so was good. such a good oh, dude. So good. Everybody was great. That movie. Everybody yeah. was so good Even in the that. villains? Oh, oh dude. dude. And, and when they went, when they took him to New York oh. and he's sleeping on the... Remember when the two Dobermans are coming at him? Oh, and he does it to the Dobies? Oh, my God. So good. What a movie. Anyway, right. we love Australia. Yeah. We really do. So that was what was really neat. It was a destination yeah. film. Destination film. Yeah, it was so cool. We upped the ante. We were in the water a lot. The mm -hmm. weather was gorgeous. It mm -hmm. was like an amazing... We, we were there for four weeks, dude. Mm -hmm. it was, I mean, oh. just shooting. You were there for three months, as you said, but... It was so yep. much fun Dude. to be able to do that and to have it be received as uh, you know people how, people loved it. So how are they not? How is Chris Hemsworth not making Crocodile Dundee? Wow! Oh my goodness! 
Paul Hogan's yeah. 83 years old. And you are That's 100% How is that not correct. on tell like that would be the coolest? They, no, they yeah. have to reboot the they franchise. They have to, dude. Him. Why would they I not mean, do it that? It would be the greatest thing ever. That's Why would the, they not do that? I'm like goosebumps. You know, uh, here's the deal. I, I normally, massive, massive, hold on. I normally would never hit. hold on. I'm not as naive to We've say We've already had our legal team copyright exactly. that idea. Well, no, that's the not point. Getting up. I'm not as naive to say an idea that's really good publicly because I would want to hijack it for myself, but that is such a good idea that I would be such a fanboy to see it's it. All I'm saying is I'm putting it out there. Wow. Make it because it, it's soft. Dude. Oh my God. Oh. Okay. So Chris Hemsworth to yes. Crocodile Dundee. Yes. Let's do this. Let's Dude, do this. That would be the coolest thing ever. We just got to write a script, guys. We got to write a, a script. And he's got brothers. He understands. He understands. Oh, dude. He understands. I think All he'd right. be down. I'm down. Let's we should do write it. a script and try to get a hold Let's of Chris. Write it. Let's Chris write Hemsworth. Three, yes. If you're American listening, guys. Hold on. Fans of Aussies. Hold on. If you're right listening Nick, to the Brotherly Love Pod, Chris. Yeah. Reach out. <laughs> exactly. We'll get in touch. Hey, guys. Your people talk to us. Absolutely. Your guys. people what an amazing talk to idea. all people. What an amazing we'll idea. We'll figure it out. Oh, Dundee. All right. I could do it. I could totally do it. You'd be amazing. Give it that, you gotta You'd give it that same tone as that first one. Amazing. Too. That, that like the real, no, incredible. No, no, no doubt. You don't put it into hyperbolic action. None of that stuff. You keep it grounded just like that first oh one. Oh, my God. That's yeah. the key. Yeah, yeah. Dude, it'd him, be so good. Dude. Oh, that'd be great. You have like the oh my, I can't oh, it'd be great. But the movie, anyway. anyway, if you haven't seen Crocodile Dundee or you haven't seen it in a while, I I highly recommend as we all do go back and watch it. It's amazing. Anyway, getting back to the question. That so it was so beautifully yes, asked. Yeah, by a lot of a lot of we, beautiful time spent together as a family. Yep. Getting to go to work as a family is such a unique experience, and we really loved it and cherished it. And yep. we did, and that's it. And, yep. and I'm so glad that you enjoyed it because that's why we do these things. Yeah, that's it what makes means it nothing all. if you guys don't enjoy it because we can enjoy it because we love each other. We love hanging out with each other but when you enjoy it it makes it all worth it so thank you for the question thank you for watching those movies thank you for listening and watching our podcast we love you much appreciation oh, to you last thing i'll just say is just because i have to is we also in australia got a dog yes named, named tiffany, tiffany who was after was, the boat after the boat that the we boat got in the movie. Watch jumping ship we, we bought her for, after the boat that she Matt was an was the aussie captain blue healer aussie blue yeah. healer bought her for two bucks out of a little cardboard box and she lived till she was 16 and, and had an amazing time with us sweetest dog was we love her ever one so of the much. most tremendous animals yep. yeah ever. she really was she was nurturing ever. and caring oh, those and dogs. sweet and protective. you remember we had i had a little a little uh a yes, little a chihuahua a little chihuahua that got out yep. in the middle of the night that's right. On our property, and we live in an area of California. There's a lot of coyotes. It's true. And I was beside and myself. And there was a storm. Horrible storm. I was beside myself, and we came out. In, I didn't realize until obviously the next morning. Woke up early. Was like, oh no! I run out the front door, and in our front yard. Yep, it's true. Soaking wet. Yeah. Was Tiffany, and she was laying there, and she looked like very strange. I was like, yeah. Tiffy, are you okay? And she starts to wag her tail, soaking wet. Yep. She gets up, and he's right and underneath. underneath is she the protected him she from protected the storm. this little guy all night. <laughs> That's my Tiffany story. I know. She I she was great, man. Just the most incredible animal. Yeah, she was ever. great. Wow. Stunning. Thank you for the question. Yep. All right. One down. Let's take another question. Let's do it. Let's keep this train going. Next question. Next question. Hey Joey, Matt, and Andy. My name is Caitlin from New Jersey. I've been a huge fan of yours forever. And I was curious. Since each of you have done so many projects over your career, which of your brother's projects is your favorite of theirs? I've always wondered that. So. Well, first of all, thank you for the yeah, question. question. By the way, from New Jersey, I know, so a little, a little fellow tri-state area, absolutely cool. human being. We, we we're we're so excited to have you here on the uh, program. Um, wow, that's an interesting question. I know. I, I, we haven't really been asked that. There's also a lot of them. It's I don't tough. Think so. It's I mean, really for me, tough. for me, look, I'll just go off and say this. I think for me, I thoroughly enjoyed the work that you did in Mrs. Doubtfire. I just loved that film, and I thought you were great in it. Uh, in terms of you, Matt, I, I, I also, I loved, I loved the job you did in Hot Chick. I thought you were just so funny in that, Thank you. that dance and that gold uh, little like string mm. bikini, the weenie bikini that you're wearing. Uh, I thought to come out of yourself, be able to pull that off and execute with. How ridiculous that outfit was! Well, do you want to know? Do you want to know a really funny thing? I don't think I've, I never, I don't think I've told you guys this. I tried had to, a huge erection. No, no, <laughs> the entire time okay. I was in that speed. No, wait, what, man? No, you're wait, what you do? Here's yeah. the thing. Here's the thing. It, it was actually, a strong breeze growing. It actually in it. gets a little deeper than that. Oh boy, I've never told this. Ever. How much? Deeper? Never told anybody this. I can't <laughs> watch that scene. Not too deep. Oh, can't watch it at all. Oh, I get all nervous and snap because I got so nervous during with the speedo. That they literally, I had to go backstage and tape everything 
into place. Oh, because you didn't want it to pop out. Exactly. Right, right, right. Well, was now, really looking back one. at it, it looks like I have zero there. Oh, my God. It looks like there is nothing. <laughs> oh, that's so And that's so because funny. I have this duct tape all around, and it's literally pulled, and it's probably in the back somewhere. Oh, my and God. And now when I, I look at it, I'm like, it. I look like I have zero. I look like I have nothing. So wow. I'm embarrassed by it because... I, I wish it now. I wish it, I at least would have had like something, you know. I think you're I the only added. <laughs> I would have yeah. stuffed a sock yeah. in there. Right. Something. You're right. probably the only person yeah. that would notice that. Yeah. Well, Thank you so much for watching this clip of the Brotherly Love Podcast. For full episodes, go to the Brotherly Love Pod's YouTube channel. Link in the description. And for exclusive weekly bonus content, join our Patreon right now. That's right. There's a link in the description for that too. Thanks so much for tuning in. Thank you. Thanks.